Hello YouTube, I'm here to make a quick tutorial today on how to use a save editor and also back up your save files. So first thing you want to do is make a backup save in case anything goes wrong you have a backup save. Right, so whenever you're using this save editor you want to do everything from the start menu. You don't want to press start, you just want it to say press any button. I'll show you. So from here. Alright, so from here you want to go to your desktop and make a backup save. Alright, so to get to your Elden Ring save folder, you need to go to your C drive, users, your name, app data, roaming, and then Elden Ring. I have two folders here because I have two accounts. You want to look up the last save you made. So this was made one minute ago. So it's this one. This is the folder you want to back up. So you want to click it. Click copy. I already have a save folder where I save these. But for the tutorial's sake, I'll make a new one. So on the desktop, new folder. You can name it anything. I'm just going to name it saves. You want to right click in here and paste. So this is your backup save folder. Alright, so and then from here, this is the save editor. I will leave a link to it in the description. So the source file. You want to click browse. So this will be the file, the character that you want onto your account. So I already have some on my computer. I'm just going to click. So wherever you have the file saved, you want to click there. You want to click open. Destination file. This will be where you... I just showed you how to get to in your C drive. So not your backup that you just made, not this one. You want to click browse. And I'll show you one more time. You go to C drive, users, your name, app data, roaming, Elden Ring, and then there'll be a number here. Like I said, I have two accounts. You just want to look for the timestamp when you last saved your game, which would be this one. And click open. Now this copy from my save has three save files to it. So there's three different characters on here. So this is each one. I'm just going to copy this character. And this is your current save folder. So your current, the name of your characters, how many of your characters you have will be here. I'm just going to over, I'm just going to overwrite this one. And click copy all right so then I get you go back to your game you should still be at this screen and here is my new save Now be sure that you back up your save in the beginning like I showed you just in case you overwrite your character and anything happens to your character you have the save. Just some tips that I learned from using this editor. Every time you back up or every time you add a save it's going to add this backup folder here. So and you need to delete those but make sure that you're always anytime you edit the save folder you need to be at the main menu screen before you press start and then you can delete these backup folders just the backups don't delete the dot s12 and it tells you to do that so you're right here Ensure you delete the backup folders. 
also so you can use this save editor to back up any of you can own, use your own personal save so you wanted to save scum and go at the end of the game and do separate endings you can reload your save and do that if you wish alright guys I think that's it for the tutorial thank you if you have any questions please leave them down in the comments